Yo, yo, what's up, what's up? Hey, back in another video. Hey, good morning. Uh, today's Friday. What I want to talk about in this video is money is money more important than relationships. And I, I feel like I have to make this video because I think we got into a place where people are now starting to put money above their relationships, above their family and raising one. And I don't care how much money I got. I'm never putting money above relationships, money above having a family, money above God. I'm never doing that. It, it talks about in um, Matthew 6, chapter 6, verse 24. It talks about you cannot serve two masters. You cannot serve money and serve God. At the same time, you either serve one and don't and, and don't like the other, but you can't serve both God and money. You either hate one or love the other, but you can't serve them at the same time. You can't, so you have to choose one. You either serve money or you can serve God. Me, I'm always going to serve God. There's not enough money in this world to to even satisfy my soul. And now I, I think a lot of people are now starting to, you know, I even think they even changing their um, mindset on the Bible. Because I feel like a lot of people is leaving the Bible now, um, especially like in the Christian community. And... Um, they out there trying to get somebody who's making over a hundred K or 200 K, 300 K. And they think money is supposed to satisfy them. Money is supposed to give them all their desires and what they want. Let's listen. Let me tell you something. You can, you can get whatever you want. You want a car, you want the new Mercedes Benz, the new Tesla, Whatever, whatever you want. You want the the new iPhones, the, you know, the latest, greatest. I don't care whatever it is that you want. You can go and get it. But then once you get that, I give it about a week or two. You're going to want something else. And then once you get something else, probably better than what you have, you're going to continue to want something else you're going to continue to want something better than that because you know why it's because it's not satisfying you you wouldn't materialistic things would never satisfy you it would never satisfy you this is why it's important to have a relationship with god because god would give you what you need the earth would give you what you want i have everything that i need I got a nice, got a nice crib, got a nice car, got clothes on my back, got food on the table. I even got me a gaming PC. I got everything that I want. I even have, you know, good relationships with my family. I got everything that I want. What more in this world do I really want? There's nothing in this world that I, that I would risk losing my relationship with God to go and chase because it's really ridiculous right now that now we get to a point where it's like in order for you to date somebody you got to be making a certain type of money like where like where are we going in this world like where why is it people being a headache and 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 losing their opportunity and finding somebody great I don't understand this because, it's, you know, in the relationships in America specifically, it's like they don't really care about raising a family or rarely anybody. But there's still some people, I'm not saying everybody, but some people care about raising a family and, and having good relationships and, and just, you know, 
wants to really raise a kid and be a father or be a mother to their kids. But a lot of people are just kind of going away from that. And now they just, all they care about is money. They want to, they want to have everything that Cardi B have. They want to have everything that Beyonce have. They want everything. They are going to continue to crave for things that are just not going to satisfy you whatsoever. And then and in Matthew uh, 6, chapter 6, it also talks about um, storing your treasures in heaven and not storing it down here where moths and rust can come in uh, it, that can you know come in to your your treasures and stuff and 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 you know thieves can come and break into your house and take it like we, that's what we that's what the time we're in right now you see a lot of crime rate is high as hell than it than it's ever been you see people going to other people's cars and taking their stuff Jesus was always right. He was always right of what's going on. He he was always right. And it's really happening right now. And people just continue to just have all this nonsense, man. Like, you know, I, I can understand why a lot of brothers are not going into other to other countries to go find wives. And I'm not saying, listen, I'm not fully uh, on board with this passport bro thing when y'all come to find love at another country and stuff because even if you go to these other countries they see what a lot of American women are doing in this country and they copying what they doing in this country and they're going to finesse you take your money from other countries because they see you oh you're American oh you got a lot of money yeah they're going to take your money because they see what a lot of um, women are doing in this country. They finessing a lot of guys. And I'm not saying a lot. I'm not saying all women, but um, a lot of them. And in order for you to date them, you or in order for you to be in a relationship, even if you were, even if you are in a relationship with them, they're going to most likely take you to court for your um, finances get you out of child support and um, which is yeah you should be paying child support but when you go to court and I've been seeing lately on these on um, watching YouTube and watching you know video clips of people in court systems and going to court about child support is that most of the most of the time those women are requiring you to pay a whole chunk of your life savings and to and just taking everything that you work hard for, which is is important for people to choose relationships over money. And it, it's so important. And, and if you know you're watching this video and, and you don't really you know care about it, then cool. You know, then go move on. And you know, you if you think that money is more important than relationships then that's on you you know but for me god is over money all day 24 7 i will always choose god always there's not a there's not enough money that i can make that i'm just gonna say oh man i don't even need god no more i don't even I don't even need this person no more. I don't need this. No. That's never going to happen. But listen, man. I hope y'all um, staying uh, safe a hey, Friday. And uh, listen, man. Y'all stay cool. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. You made it to the end of this video, man. Hit that like and subscribe button. I love y'all. And just stay focused on your journey with God. And... Know that don't ever put money before God. Don't ever do that. Now, you need money to survive. You need money, you know, to go about your life, to go take care of business and stuff. But leave money down here. Leave money down here and, and put God up here. Way higher than that. 
So I appreciate y'all for watching my video. I love y'all. Peace.